The common theme across the three plays presented in Beckett Times 3 is the relationship between the consciousness and the subconsciousness. We then started to talk about how to realise uh, that relationship uh, in a cohesive design um, and began with uh, uh, trying to land um, the world that Beckett had tried to create and, and where this very abstract world could potentially exist. Some of the themes uh, referred to purgatory, a sense of waiting, a sense of endless repetition. There's quite a cyclical nature to each of the plays. Um, so I began by um, looking at waiting spaces uh, and trying to look at elements that I could use that will give the audience a sense of recognition that actually when it's all put together um, it, it's an abstracted version of that reality. So with the three elements of the, the three boxes, uh, each play is able to emerge from within the box. Because we went with the box concept, we had to make sure that the actors were comfortable in the spaces that we'd created for them. Trying to link all three plays together and ensure that there was um, a powerful image to represent Beckett times three and make sure that image at the same, at the same time could step back and withdraw itself so that the, the key uh, focus points of each of the three plays stood on their own, which is of course the mouth and the urns in play and, uh, and the two sacks and the goad for Act Without Words too.